Mapman2006 here. Today we have an unboxing for a Lava Mic UA1, and we might even do um, a 10 foot uh, 3.5 audio cable. So, what this is good for is if you want to get really good audio, like right now, you can hear buzzing noise in the background, probably. That's my computer on. So, with a mic, you can actually attach it to you and not hear anything except for what is in front of the, you know, in, sp in front of the speaker or whatever, whatever you're doing. So this is the product that you can get at Best Buy. I can't remember how much it was. It's been a while since I've had it. Something just fell. <laughs> and my camera just blurred. What was that? No. A lot of things in my room right now. And, yeah, so besides that point, um, but yeah, this is a mic that you can just attach to a, uh, sweatshirt or, you know, stuff like that. They, they do also make other ones that are wireless. So this is not a wireless one. This has a cord inside. So let's get inside of it. All right. If I can get inside of it. There we go. So you can use this for like interviews and stuff like that. Uh, if you're into doing interviews, um, I don't really do interviews at the sport events. Obviously, right now there's no sports going on. But if there was a sport event going on, I don't usually do interviews. So it doesn't really matter. Oh, it comes with a little. Okay, so it comes with some uh, stickers, and I'm betting the device is in this nice little carrying case it has. Okay, so no cord. Okay, nice, nice. And this is it, right here. So I thought there was another device inside of here. Oh, no. Hmm, interesting. So this is not what I was just thinking it would be. Oh, wait a minute, it is there, okay. So this end, I was, gonna, I was a little confused because I was saying it should have it. Um, so this is actually a mic, so this is the lapel that you can attach. And then this end would go into your smartphone. So this is actually meant for the smartphone device, like a, um, what is it good for? Apple, because it's got the lightning connection. But on this other end over here, it detaches, and then you can plug in a camera one. So let's try that out. So let's just attach that there. Ah, stay there. That's where I got this little um, 10 foot cable. But if you want to use the, like a phone to record yourself, that's a perfect thing to use. Cause it's not, you know, it's pretty good. Um, we'll test that out later on in this video. Um, not with not with the mobile one because I don't have an iPhone. I have a Samsung, which I might be showing off later on. So this connects into here, which again then you know makes it longer. So you can be farther apart. And if I come around to my mic on my camera, why not try it out right now? So can you hear me much better? You can still hear that um, noise in the background, but it's not as permanent. Um, and so that's what's really nice about this kind of mic, is you can put it on yourself and you can talk into it and you can hear much better. Ooh, it just changed. Um, but yeah, it, it's a much better mic because it only gets in what you're recording. So you can't see me right now, but I am talking into the mic through the camera and the camera automatically detected that I am using a mic. And then it, it, it doesn't catch anything else in the background because it's hearing my voice. Now, I'm not really going to do another video like me. I mean, maybe I will. Maybe I'll go outside and, and you can um, see it a little bit more in action. Because this is a 10-foot cable. So, I could be 10 feet from the camera doing interview, put it on my, underneath my clothes. Because this 10-foot this cable is pretty long. So, this, this cable is long enough so you could do stuff like that. Um, and that's what's great about this kind of mic is you can do better reviews. And if you didn't know... Audio is one of the most 
things that you need to know about doing videos. If you don't have good audio, people are not going to watch your videos. If you have good audio, then you might get more views. And, you know, on YouTube, it's all about the views and the subs and, and all that good stuff there. So, that's why I did this video first, because I figured, and I have a few videos to come up on the channel this week um, in particular. Um, this is the first one, because I figured the audio, like you said, in, the, in, in, in live streams and videos, audio is the most important thing in any kind of video. You cannot hear that humming anymore. Can you? I can't. Because I have a headphone on in the camera as well. So I can hear what I'm saying. So I can say, okay, I, I can hear no humming in the background. That's the nice thing about this mic is it's very good, um, like I said, for anything. So you can't hear that humming. Um, the nice thing about this is you can, you, know, you can still video and zoom in and out on the camera. But you're getting better audio. Like I said, video... Um, on the other hand, is a good thing to have. Keep in mind, um, the video on any camera should be in good quality. Um, but like I said, some people, um, I've heard this online, is um, through YouTubers and saying what you should do and what you shouldn't do. I heard somewhere that one person uploaded a video with great quality of audio, but the video wasn't good and he got a lot of views because it was about the audio whatever he was trying to say in the video. And it was like a, you know, like a phone. I don't know what kind of phone it was, but it was a, a phone video. So, um, yeah. So, pretty much this device is very good. It's, like I said, it's a mic. Uh, it comes with uh, the connection for your phone, for an iPhone in particular. They do carry other ones for, like, Samsungs and stuff like this. But this particular one is for a iPhone. Um, I don't have an iPhone, but I got this so I could do a video on it and show you what it is. And and that's pretty much what I wanted to do in this episode. Um, in a minute, I will go out back just so you can hear it outside. And you can hear see me in front of it, um, in front of the camera, just so you can get a little bit better audio test of it. Um, right now, I'm in my room, so, you know, there's background noise. But you really can't hear it, even with my computer being on. Like, in the beginning, you could hear the computer making noises. And I can't hear it. I mean, I can hear it kind of with if I didn't have the mic on, you know, my headphone on. But I can't hear it with the mic. So, that's a good thing. That's a very good thing. So, in a minute, we are going to transfer outside. Um... And I will do a quick video out there just so you can see the audio levels and, and the video quality as well. Um, because I know right now my camera has been, is, is not doing so good. It hasn't been used in several months, so I figured I should do a video. I haven't done a video on YouTube, particularly like a review product. Um, and if you guys want more product reviews, I know I'm going to be doing a few in the next few days. Or maybe all one day. I don't know. It depends on what I'm going to do. But yeah, if you want more reviews like this, let me know in the comment section. I do look at all comments. I might not post every comment, but I do read all comments. So, in a second, we'll see you outside. So now we're outside out my backyard, and you can see that I have the mic up here. Like I said, it's a Papel mic, so you can probably hear me pretty clearly. I don't have my headset, so I can't hear you. But you can see that the mic, um, I'm pretty far, probably about six feet from the computer, from the camera. Um, and you can hear me probably pretty good. So uh, I just want to show off the audio a little bit here. And um, the audio, like I said, is probably pretty good from when I tested just a little bit ago to make sure that you could hear me. Um, the audio is pretty good. So uh, hopefully you enjoyed this episode of this Papel mic. And um, until my next review here on the channel. I'm going to say where I normally say it in my, in my videos, and that is bye bye for now.